time. Hi, my name is Faye and I make polymer made clay jewelry just like this one. I'll leave my Etsy page link down below. And today we're gonna learn how to attach earring posts to your earrings. The super glue I use is Gorilla Glue, the one with the little brush and nozzle. It's called brush and nozzle. So you're gonna grab the back of your piece, grab the tiniest, tiniest, tiniest bit of glue, and then you're gonna Hold it for 10 seconds. Once you've done that, I let mine sit overnight. Here I have a piece that has already sat overnight. And the next thing I like to do is grab matching color, just like this, roll it flat, and then put it through the earring post and just blend it in. And if you didn't know, you can actually bake your projects multiple times. I don't know the limit, but I always bake mine twice. Then throw it into the oven. Now, one mistake I did recently was I baked it with the jump ring on my piece and something happened and all my pieces got destroyed. But yeah, just bake it according to your packaging instructions. You can bake it multiple times and it'll be okay. If you are worried that your project is gonna burn, one thing that you can do is grab some aluminum foil, place it over your piece in the oven just like this and that'll prevent the direct heat from hitting your project. But I don't do this and I've never had a project burn yet and hopefully that never happens. Um, but that's just in case you don't trust your oven's temperature. And once you let it cool your project, here's a completed project. Looks just like that. And I, ha I haven't had one break yet. Fingers crossed that doesn't happen, but it seems to be really strong. Now keep in mind there are multiple ways to do this. There's no one right way to attach your earring post to your earrings, but this is the way I do this and it works really well for me. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know if this method works for you or if you use a different method. Leave my Instagram right here. You can show me your projects, what you're working on, and then you can look at mine. We'll follow each other and support each other. I'll also leave my Etsy page down below and let me know if you have any questions. See you next time. Bye!